Today we're going to be taking this apart and cleaning it up, shooting a little paint on it. Stay tuned. Okay guys, today we're going to be taking this apart, kind of scuffing this up a little bit with some sandpaper. I don't know how I'm going to clean that plastic yet, but uh, we're just going to, and we're going, if I can, we're going to take the mechanism out of here and um, just going to sand it off a little bit, shoot some paint on it. I can't finish the, uh, the uh, scooter yet because the bird is back now this is what we did I've got it hooked up to a monitor <laughs> and it's recording 24 7 so but she's been going in there and making her nest all morning so um, I don't even want to move it I know she's getting ready to lay eggs springtime and all so anyway back to this thing I'm gonna put you on the stand Well, this don't have a lock in it, so this comes up off. Set this aside. Plastic piece comes off, and it's got some red around the bottom here. And we will be painting that. I'll set this aside. Not much of a workbench, I know, guys. And then this part comes off like that. There is a dime in there that, that we was using to try it out. And there's the bottom piece. So, somebody's messing. Oh, monkey's messaging me. So that's what we're going to do. Um... We're going to, okay, baby, she's texting me from work, or messaging me. Um, we're, we're not going to make it perfect, you know, we just want to get some of this rust off. We're going to shoot a little paint on it, and, and um, that's what we're going to do with that. We're not trying to restore it, it's not that old, so if the paint was better, I would just clean the paint up, but... There you go, works good. And uh, just keep it like that. But it's not really vintage per se. So I'm not going to bore you with the sanding. But I will sand some of this off here. You know, and first thing I'm, I'm going to do is get this, get the mechanism out of that, that off. I'm going to get the rest of that lock out. I think it's just a screw. And I'm going to clean it up and then I'm going to go from there. I'm not going to bore you with all the sand and stuff. But I'll show you some clips as we progress. So hang in there and stay tuned. I'll be right back with you guys. Okay guys, so this is what we're looking at so far. I've got it tore down. took about five minutes. The, the bolts are Phillips or standard. And you can see here maybe how rusty they were. But actually they came right out. So, so anyway, that's, that's what we're looking at so far. So I'm going to get all this cleaned up the best I can, get some sanding done, and I'll get back with you as soon as I get that done. So stay tuned. All right, guys, we're back. This is what we came up with. As you can see, it's not by any means perfect, but uh, like I said, we don't want to be because... It's just a cheap Taiwan thing, and because these things, these it's not really vintage, vintage. So if you take a look at that, just remember one thing: these ones with the plastic cover or the plastic globe. I mean, they are literally a dime a dozen. But anyway, that's what we come out with. I painted outside, I dropped the the lid of it, and got a little dirt on it. And, Stuff like that, but it gives it more character. I've got a few pieces of candy in here. So let's just see if this thing's going to work for us. 
Okay, I got it sitting up on my prop. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can get you in the shot here. Yeah, that should do it. Let's see what we got. Take my little dime, put it in there, and there's that. And we've got candies. It only gave me four. But that's that's fine. There's this thing. Well, it's, it's low too. There's a thing inside there that you can adjust and make it wider um, for like gumballs or. Or, or make it not as wide for like smaller candy so a whole bunch don't just keep coming out so it probably needs adjusted let's get our dime back there's our dime let's do this again like I said there's not much in here but just something I had to try it out. I wanted to see something come out of it, so. There's that. Alright, let's try this again. Alright. There, still in it. Okay. Put my dime in. There we go. Oh, yeah. A lot more that time. That's about right. It's about right, right there, so. My hands are dirty. Alright, guys. So there we go. We got that. And I said stay tuned for more videos. Keep an eye out for Monkey 1000, her channel. And let's see. The bird's been building that nest all day long. So we're still watching on the, because I don't want to go out and bother her. So I don't know. But anyway, she's been in and out of there, flying in and out. So there you go guys, I don't, it looks red in this camera, I don't know what it's going to look like once I upload it, or it looks orange, I'm sorry, in this camera, it is actually red, red, like fire engine red, that's what she picked out and that's what she wanted and I think it looks fine, the globe we're just going to, you know, clean off real good and, and leave it like it is, you know, because I don't know if she wants to put peanuts in it, cashews, there's these little things that you can get just at the stores in these machines, uh, they're called runts, I do believe, and, and and there's like little different kinds of fruit, uh, hard candy, and she likes the bananas, so I think she'll probably get a couple big bags of that and put in there, and then I'm going to have to keep her stocked up in dimes. <laughs> Me too. But anyway, so, well, there we go. All right, guys. Anyway, again, thanks for watching. Keep an eye out for Monkey 1000, and as soon as that bird gets done making up her mind what she wants to do in the scooter, then we'll know what I'm going to do with that. So anyway, guys, uh, there you go. Another little upload for you. Just a quick, it's not really a, although you know what, it's, it, it is not a, 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 actually a restoration. It's just kind of a quick paint job, but that thing would be easy to re restore if I really wanted to. I mean, all I'd have to do is get another globe. And really like sandblast because that's all that's all cast aluminum all that so I could sand it real good or sandblast it and and uh, really make it nice and get something that goes in here I think you can order them online or I may just make moon stick or something but it's real easy to take part like I said about five minutes about five minutes put back together and a little bit of sand and painting no biggie all right guys I'm gonna say so long and she bear I'm gone be cool, guys. We'll chat again soon.